We are back with Tom, and I am Michelle Vita. We have a few more questions for you. Okay. Um, we were wondering, how did you get into photography, which is another one of your hobbies? Uh, photography, I'd always been into the art of photography uh, ever since I broke into comics, but it was just more like admiring the pictures, what makes a good photograph uh, compared to you know an average photograph, and um, always just kind of taking pictures as a hobby. It was like bodybuilding in that it was my release from the workload of comic books. So you know when I'm working on something, I usually seek something in a different area just to. You know, just just to relieve the stress and just to relax a bit. Photography was one of uh, those things. Um, I guess, geez, I don't even remember. I, I somehow I started a few years ago. I started getting paid for it. I don't even remember how. Um, I think it was taking someone's senior photos. Um, I just remember uh, someone asked me, um, "Hey, you you do all that Photoshop stuff, right? Can you take my senior pictures?" And uh, I didn't know too much about the technical side of photography. I had a, like a, a DSLR and stuff like that, but I really use it on automatic. And then um, me not wanting to back down from any challenge, um, I didn't want to disappoint, and, and I just confidently said, yeah, yeah, I can do that stuff. And then as soon as I got home, like, what did I get myself into? So I started looking up stuff on lighting, on reflectors, on what lenses to use, what lights to use. And I'm the type of guy that if I start to get really obsessed about an idea, I, I will literally spend days and nights on the computer researching it, practicing it in, in, in person, in real life, and, and, and until I get proficient at it. You know, I did that with, basically I gave myself a crash course in photography, and then somehow word of mouth got out, I did more shoots, I started getting offered money for it, I did some, you know, gigs, you know, with my knowledge in the fitness and bodybuilding, I started doing that, that took off, and then I got you know, I offered more gigs, uh, you know, I did a catalog and uh, I did a shoot for a supplement company and then, uh, uh, what else, and then one thing led to another, this agency saw my work, offered me to, to do uh, photography for their newly signed models and just kind of took off, so I was kind of fortunate that I was able to turn, turn another hobby into uh, a paying job. So uh, that's how I got into it. And then one of the after I figured out some of the more basic things like lighting and camera settings, I thought, why am I wasting time drawing and painting pinup models when I could just take a picture of them really quick and, and be done with it? You know, a painting would take me a week sometimes to do. A, when I say a week, I mean like a full 40 hour work week. Mm -hmm. And photography, I'll just take a picture and retouch it, you know, and they can have like, you know, pictures in like a day. So yeah. that's, that's how I got into it. You know, it's, it's fun. You know, I. I like uh, I like to take pictures when I'm traveling everywhere, you know, city. You no, know, it's not just models. Although that's a good reason uh, to get into photography. You see a lot of posers, uh, but uh, you know, I like taking pictures of nice things everywhere. Okay. Um, for computers and comic book artistry, how do you feel about doing it a traditional way versus more on the computer, like some people do? Uh, well, it is a digital age, and I used to be adamantly against digital. Uh, like Photoshop stuff because I, I used to think that it was like an easy way of doing art, too easy, too easy of a way out, almost like cheating in some ways because you're not getting your hands dirty doing it the old school way of, uh, you know, pencil and paper. And I still do a lot of traditional pencil paper stuff, um, well, the majority of my work is. But I've, I've been able to adapt a little bit and incorporate some coloring and some painting and drawing, even drawing. A lot of the demos that I'll be doing for my ArtSamurai.net series workshops will be um, on Photoshop, live on you know, computer. I use a little tablet and I just use like a, a little pen that acts like a mouse mm -hmm. and you just draw like normal on there. So that's, cool. uh, I'm incorporating more digital. Okay, um, for, I know you have your two books. Were you ever planning on coming out with a third book or something like that? Um, I do have something in the works. Um, it'll be in the form of an ebook, so maybe an app or a PDF. And I'm currently casting beautiful models for it. So that's all <laughs> I'll say right now. Cool. Sounds pretty cool. Thank you again. Yes. Thank you.